and showcase um, their cultural performing arts. I'm here everyone, my name is Kerry and I'm a Māori student recruitment advisor here at the University of Waikato. Um, at Timatitani, I'll be performing for Te Rōpū Kapaka Whānau uh, Apanui, which is an evening ball. Um, it's really special for us and our Rōpū because we are one of the only iwi groups, so um, we'll be representing our iwi and our Fano at Timatitani, which is um, a big highlight because it's the biggest um, Māori event in the world. It'll be fun. It's going to be really great because there are three pools um, and each pool has a different mix of groups from different places with different styles, um, styles of singing, styles of standing, so it'll be varied and really fun for everybody. It's also going to be in Rotorua, which is probably uh, one of the big tourist capitals of the country. Um, where Kapahaka is, is well nurtured there. Um, we'll be expecting lots of uh, tourists, um, people from overseas, as well as um, whole whānau being able to come um, to the as a great place to be hosting the event. Kia ora, ko hae mano e titi tōku ingoa, hiure no te whānau apanui. Uh, my role here at the University is Māori Recruitment and Stakeholder Advisor. Perform for Tawira Mai Tapiti. Uh, we're a group based on Fana uh, Apanui. We're, we're a youth based group. Uh, quite a lot. Uh, first and foremost, it's about um, representing our iwi um, and in front of the national stage. Um, and, and again, showing, showing our wares to, to the country, I suppose. And it's the only competition of its kind. So. It allows Māori to express themselves in, <coughs> in a way that is purely Māori, um, which, is, which is also good. By way of those cultural performing arts, you can actually gauge the well-being of the Māori people through their art. of all the different tribes within New Zealand, the whakawhanaungatanga between different groups and the oneness of the Māori people. I think my main supporters will be my family and that's really all that matters. With a week's worth of sleep, hopefully, <laughs> if my boss will let me. <laughs> Kia ora, my name is Linda Tiaho and I'm a Senior Lecturer and the Associate Dean Māori here in Te Peringa Faculty of Law. Um, I've been involved in Kapahaka since I was a child, um, performing uh, mainly here in the Waikato Rohe. Uh, my iwi affiliations are Ngāti Koroki Kahukura, um, Maunga Tautari is my mountain and Waikato is my river and Waikato Tainui. I've joined a group called Waihirere, which is a well-known group from the East Coast, Te Tairawhiti. And I've been a performer in the Waihirere group for the past three Matatini festivals. And this will be my fourth uh, if I'm picked in the team. Uh, Live-ins or, or wānanga uh, since about October, November, once a month. 
prior to Christmas, but since Christmas it's been every weekend. So my family travels from here in Hamilton down to Gisborne every weekend on a Friday and we come back on Sunday night. So a lot of effort and energy uh, goes into the build up to Te Matatini and so I hope that everybody supports every group that makes the stage because it's a lot of hard work that's gone into each bracket. I love of singing and a love of performing, a love of being on the stage.